Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I know that in the last couple of days, more like 10 days, I've been slacking and I forgot to post videos for my 30 day challenge of Epilepsy Awareness Month. So basically this whole video is going to be on the days that I missed, which is like 10 days. So I have my iPad here so I can look back on my Instagram account to what I have posted so I kind of get a recap of what to say in here. So, for day 19, uh, basically that was just about Lazy Saturday. So I just posted a photo on Instagram, which I'm going to link in the strip description box below my Instagram account. So you guys can see all that stuff, because I'm not going to sit here describing Lazy Sunday or Saturday, because I didn't do much. Also, sorry about my dog barking. She's going to be barking up there for a little bit. So, I'm sorry. Okay, so I think my dog might be done barking or be wrapping it up. So, day 20th, or no, day 19, was just about my rough day, which was... Kind of like when you have to do math on baking. Like, math shouldn't be done on something fun. But, like, sometimes you have to do it. But, like, I get the reasons. But sometimes it's just, like, a problem. Like, is anyone supposed to know this? So, basically, what I had to do was I wanted to make half of a recipe. And one of them that I had to convert into half was three-fourths of a cup. And I'm like, what is that? I'm like, is it tablespoons, teaspoons, I mean, how much? And it ended up being six tablespoons, which I had to look up and all that, which took a little bit. And so it took an hour to make my chocolate waffles. I mean, it's not an easy recipe. It's kind of hard. Um, moving on. So day, wait, I think. Yeah. I don't know what happened, but I think I said day 19 for the last one. It was supposed to be day 18, and the other one, the lazy Saturday, was day 17. Sorry. Um, so day 19, snack attack. Um, I'm not going to worry about explaining that one. You can just check out my Instagram account. Day 20th, Favorite Warrior, and I just explained about in middle school how there was a counselor that I just really, really was my favorite warrior. She was, well, it wasn't when I was in middle school, but before I went to middle school, she was like, she had breast cancer, and she fought it, and she was able to get through it, and then when I came to middle school in seventh grade, I got my seizures again. And she helped me get through that, and she's just my favorite warrior, and we both have, like, similar passions. We both love to hike, so. Next day was day 21, and it was a quote, and I just combined it two quotes because they're my favorite, and I wanted to change it up. I didn't want to say one quote, so I just did two, so. One is, keep moving forward, and adventures are out there. Uh, one is from Meet the Robinsons movie, which is Keep Moving Forward by Walt Disney. And then adventures are out there is from the, uh, I think it's, it might be a Disney movie too, uh, Up. Then the next day, day 22, was Biggest Challenge. So my biggest challenge would have to be homework. So I just posted a photo which had all my homework on it. The next day was inspiring other people. And so I did a little post on a camp that I went to. It was an epilepsy camp and I met a lot of people there. So I just kind of inspired them and they did the same to me. Day 26 was type of seizures. And I pulled up a picture that showed like your brain or a brain or something and it just kind of showed like where the seizures come from and the different types but I didn't break it down and explain the types so what I did is 
I went and made my own little diagram with using my fancy markers and paper. I made my diagram of the type of seizures I have, and I explained them. So my type of seizures are focal seizures, or no, also known as partial seizures. They're, they are seizures which affect only one part of the brain. Then what I usually get after that is a secondary generalized, and it's a partial seizure involving the generalized seizures. And then after that, I get a generalized toxin clonic, which is a type of seizure that involves a loss of consciousness. Oh, I think I said that wrong. Sorry. Uh, but it involves, like, shaking and you kind of, like, just black out. So I guess that's an easier way to say it. And then I have one more post, which is yesterday's. Um, I'm going to see if I can try to do today's post, but if it involves a lot of thinking, I may have to come back to it, and I'm just looking at how long I've been recording, and it's been five minutes, but I kind of knew it would be long because I missed a lot of days, and usually each video that I make is a minute long or so, so yeah, uh, my post that I did yesterday was the struggle is real. Um, I want you guys to check that out on my Instagram. I'm not going to really explain it a lot because there's a lot that I could have picked for this post. I could have done homework. I could have done hiking. A really big hill. So it just really depends. But if you are someone with epilepsy, you're really going to know this post. Um, so today's post, which is... One second. Day 28. No, wait. I think I skipped a day. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm just realizing this. So, what happened is I went from day 24, which was type of epilepsy, to day 27, struggle is real. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this, but I'm going to switch my camera in right now. Okay, guys, so what actually ended up happening, so this is a better explanation, is that I thought day 25 was day 27, the struggle is real, so I flip-flopped them. So basically, today's post is supposed to be purple flower, even though that was supposed to be posted yesterday. I don't know, but it'll add up and it'll work, but I just messed it up and I'm sorry about that. Well, maybe, oh, well, it was because I skipped it by mistake. Um, I don't know. So. Anyhow, since I'm on here, please follow my Instagram account. Enough of me chit-chatting. Let me just end this YouTube video with a good note and just saying check this out um it does say that i'm a songwriter and that is true i'm working on an album with my dad it should be out before january because i'm working on the final draft of it and i'll let you guys know on my instagram account when it will come out to youtube and all that and you will eventually see it on youtube so yeah i'm excited i hope you are too Please like and subscribe so you don't miss anything, and I'll see you guys next time.